Welcome back. Now we preview George the Greek. The New York Debts. I thought this song would be appropriate uh, for George's team. Lazy Mary. Song played during the seventh inning stretch of that game after uh, Take Me Out to the ball game. Um, George's team, George's team, obviously being the New York Jets. George is a big uh, Mets fan. So, we'll give you a second, George, to take this in. Well, uh, George the Greek, his team uh, more focused on offense than pitching, although there is some talent there uh, with the pitching staff, but let's start with his offense. Um, Robinson Cano, uh, we know uh, obviously MVP type guy. Uh, could, you know, have another MVP season. Uh, last year, 29 homers, 103 runs, 109 RBI, only 77 strikeouts and 626 at-bats. The guy batted 319, 73 extra base hits, led uh, would be his team leader uh, if the numbers uh, would all you know, fall the same for George. Uh, young guy, Mike Stanton. A lot of people love him. Um, Mark Merco had a big year last year. Uh, I'm not too sure. We'll see if he can repeat that. Um, Pablo Sandoval had a down year. A lot of people are saying he came you know, to camp. Uh, he lost weight. He's stealing bases again. Andre Heath here. Um, you know, he brought a little power. 23 homers, 82 RBI last year. Uh, 292 average, so uh, not bad. Yeah, there. Carlos Quinton, uh, I know can bring some power to the table. Uh, 26 homers and only 453 at bats last year. He has Angel from God. Uh, gotta like that. Brett Cardinal, uh, also to bring uh, speed. Mark Reynolds all on the bench. Uh, we know he has power. Jason Fay's on the DL right now. Uh, so the guy's got a lot of depth on offense. Um, a lot. He's got power. Um, he's got some speed uh, when he needs to bring it. Um, you know, a very well-rounded offense, uh, extra base hits, average, it's all there. Uh, on uh, pitching, he's got Tim Lincecum. Um, you know, uh, what he can do, David Price, John Lester. So three big, big names right there. Uh, Mike Pelfrey, Madison Baumgartner, um, Jordan Zimmerman, Derek Lowe, R.A. Dickey, uh, Jonathan Neese. Um, so, it's, you know, some names. He, uh, he's got depth at pitching. Uh, relievers. Uh, he's got K. Rod, uh, Matt Caps. Although they said uh, right away that Joe Nathan is going to be um, the closer right out of the gate. Um, John Roush. Uh, we'll see. Uh, you know what saves opportunities he gets. Um, and uh, that looks like that's everybody. So he's got a lot of depth with the starters on offense. Those Winscom, Price, Lester. Uh, we know what they can do. Um, he's got George. This is a playoff team. I don't think there's really much arguing about it. Uh, we didn't mention Josh Tolley, a catcher. Um, you know, he has potential, uh, as we all met fans will tell you. So um, this this looks like a playoff team. This looks like, you know, um, maybe the most well-rounded team thus far because he's got the three aces. Uh, he's bringing Cano. Um, you know, if Stanton, Pagan, uh, Canarco, Paul, you know, kind of come through, um, you know, the offense is going to be right there. I mean, the offense is not, you know, going to punch you out, but, um, you know, if, if maybe George wants to go to speed one week, he can do that, uh, bring in Gardner, um, you know, dial back on uh, some of his pop. I mean, uh, he probably is going to bring more power and RBI, uh, extra base hits and anything else, but, um, you know, with Gardner and uh, Begon, um, you know, he can steal a bag or two. Um, so, uh, the team's to be reckoned with. I think he's, he's, he's going to pitch, he's going to hit. This team's going to the playoffs. So, uh, good job, George. Uh, one of the best teams uh, we've seen again thus far. And uh, we'll see him out there this year.